loved it. They Huge went cheer. crazy when you walked That was my first time seeing that full clip. Yes, I think besides Adriana Lima retiring, they said the reaction to you seeing you walk the runway was, was, the, biggest. Deep, was the biggest reaction. Yeah, I, I heard it and I was stunned. I could have cried. I actually could have cried just now watching that, to oh. be honest. <laughs> what does it feel like? What are you thinking when you're going down the runway? Um, so I was saying to my best friend, the only thing that I wish I did was like walked harder, but I was so scared to trip. So I don't walk any harder? What do like, you mean, like strut more? A harder strut, you know, like a more powerful walk. Oh no, it looked I feel good. like it was really like sweet and beautiful, but I wanted it to be like Naomi Campbell. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> no. <laughs> but there'll be other shows. I'm sure next year. Yeah, ask hopefully. You back. Fingers crossed. Yeah, I, I really, really wish to do it next year as well. But um. I was happy with the walk, though. I'm wondering, though, had you know, when you started off in the modeling world, did you have people turned you away and said somebody with a skin condition, vitiligo, like you have, you know, there, there's no room for that in this business. Did you yeah, get that? For sure. Um, I didn't actually want to be a model. I um, I wanted to be a journalist, but a lot of my friends told me that I should and asked me to model their like clothing wear that they were making back in the day in Toronto, and. Um, I ended up asking my mom if she could take me to some like castings and like some yeah. agencies. Remember this one, um, like the head of this agency, she was like, oh, your bone structure is beautiful. You're such a beautiful girl, but we wouldn't know what to do with you. And if you want to be like anywhere near the, the industry, you should probably be like a makeup artist. And I was like, wow, what? Like that was such a slap in the face. Yeah. But um, I think life is just about like taking those no's and like turning them into what you want them to be which are obviously yeses and um yeah you just have to work towards your goals and not take no for an answer i Adam love winnie we were talking about let's talk about your name <laughs> when i saw it i'm like oh i just love me some winnie harlow you chose this name winnie from where yeah so actually it was in high school this has been like my nickname for the longest time so people think i like changed my name for work but I, I've been called Winnie since like I was 16 years old. I love it. Wow. Yeah, um, it's actually from Winnie Harlow. I mean, Winnie the Pooh. Uh, Winnie <laughs> yeah. Harlow is from Winnie the Pooh, and Harlow is from Jean Harlow. Ooh. Yeah. I like that. Mm -hmm. I'll be your piglet. I love yeah. this <laughs> Winnie the Pooh right there. So great. Talk about high school, though, because you had a hard high school. Yeah. Right, high school years, bullying and... Yeah, but I think everyone has like a really difficult time in school, you know? That's when you're really focused on what everyone else thinks and like right. being cool and wearing the cool clothes. So I think a lot of people try to focus a lot on the fact that I was bullied, but I feel like so many people were bullied growing up. So while it was like in, um, in due part to my skin, people are bullied for so many things mm -hmm. from being, you know, different. Um, so yeah, I mean, it was difficult, but... It just takes learning to appreciate your opinion of yourself more than other people's opinion of you. Now take that, bullies, right? Yeah, right I mean, there. Look, look who's walking the Victoria's Secret runway now. Nah, I mean, I like right? to focus more on my loved ones, so. Yes. <laughs>